Hi everyone, I'm Lorenzo and in this video I'm going to talk about all James Bond games on the GameCube. James Bond Agent Under Fire is a first person shooter with extras that spice things up and add up to an enjoyable experience. You can use gadgets and weapons and I like that the levels, even though linear, the developers left you the option to tackle the level how you want. For example, right from the start, you can hack the door or get through the ventilation shaft. There are multiple ways to handle a level. And aside the running and gunning, you also get vehicle levels. I like the game. It's varied and action-packed. I liked it. And you should definitely check it out. The game mechanics are really nicely done. They make you feel badass. James Bond Nightfire has the same game formula as Agent Under Fire. It's a first person shooter with vehicular levels and shooting levels in between. And it's a well made sequel. It feels improved, you get more gadgets and the levels are more varied. Now in this videos I intend to be brief and since it will take me a lot of time to detail everything the game got, I recommend you Gaming Pastimes Review. I will leave a link in the video description. So if you want something brief, just know that it's Agent Under Fire improved. And it's just as epic. Prepare for a great experience. I had fun in the game. I felt epic. Jeans Bond Everything or Nothing is a great game, not just as a tying game, but as a standalone game too. The game is linear and you have to shoot your way through waves of enemies, you get some vehicle sequences and shooting sequences, and you even get split screen multiplayer, and here you can play both the campaign together and some multiplayer modes. In single player James Bond has the Bond sense, which highlights enemies. You also get gadgets, the lock on system is a bit clunky, but not enough, not, but not clunky enough to hinder the fun. I like that you have some open-ended areas too, and the locales are beautiful. The only bad part about the game was that the checkpoint system isn't that great. If you die, you get restarted from the beginning of the mission. Ok, so this was the video. If you liked it, please hit the like button and subscribe. If you want, you can follow me on Twitch, Instagram or Discord. And if you want to see another video of mine, just wait till I stop talking and terribly thumbnails of other videos I've made. Thanks for watching.